We are very lucky this week because we have two days without Cozy, which means we can be very hands-on yet again, get lots of work done, speed this van process, because we are fully against the clock now. You're not actually. Barbecue in here. What we having? Burgers. So we're gonna to have to tend to that now, aren't we, for the next couple of hours? We're probably gonna stink as well. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna go and make a cup of tea now. Right. But... Yeah. What's wrong with you? The cardboard is now on fire. Oh, come on. Well that's why you take it out the cardboard. I'm a fire enthusiast, but this is ridiculous. I don't know who puts me in charge of these things, but No one! Right. Well, I'll remember that next time then. It's already like on fire. Oh, I've cheesed your floor. I'll pick it up then. I think this is perfect use of our time whilst here converting the van. What is life if you're not enjoying yourself? I think if this was what building a van looks like, it would be more attractive to a lot of people. Well, this is the van life aspect of this. You can't be above. Yeah. Well, well, we're outside the van. That's true. We're technically already van life in here, aren't we? Right, Dave, we're up. You want one? You like it rare, you said? You could eat that. You'd be fine. I could eat it. I'm not going to eat it, though. Oh. Hot that. But, but Dave! Is that mine? Oh, it's got a bit of floor on it now. I'm not having that cheek. Look at the state of that. Oh. You, you, I think you have that one. No, that's my one. Oh, drag it back on the floor again. You know what? Give it here. <laughs> oh. Whoever cooked that is doing a great job. It's all right, Hello. isn't it? Mm. Good. Mm. That was good. Oh, I like a wagyu burger. Okay, so we tried this job the other day, um, and unfortunately, Cozy wasn't having it, bless him, so we had to go home. But we're back. Dave has once again set us the challenge of completing this by ourselves. Chip it. Oh, no. Well, we're starting with something a bit different today because Dave has left us to our own devices to uh, do something ourselves. Here's the material. Somehow this has got to go on this, but we can't just do it any old way. We've got to stretch it or something and it's got to look good. So I've already explained to Liana what's, what's being done. Right. So I shouldn't have to repeat myself. No. I know exactly what we're doing. Okay. Yeah. You, you are, you've got Cozy to, to guide you as well. The key thing to remember, underside there, yes. we don't want any joins. Any what? Pull that face. What happened? I've already had the explanation, but you're looking at I'm, me. Okay. I know what I'm doing. You need to tell him. But right. I don't Either. need to know if you know. Well, yeah, yeah. go and stand there. We don't want any joins there. What's that mean? It means when you sat in the driver's seat, mm. and you don't you want to see it. Above your head, that's what you're seeing. Okay. That side is inside the cupboard, and you know that that's inside the cupboard because of what I've done is I've written inside and cupboard there. He has done that. So we, this will have all the joints. All the joints you want in there. What about the other side? The so that side is not inside oh, the cupboard. Oh, there's only two sides. What I should do really is I should have written outside of the cupboard. So no joints on that side. Go bop. Right, that's fine. Into How does it go? Thing. Bop. Like that. <laughs> Wait, what? So when it goes in, what? Well, how's it go? So, you, we'll lift it up and we'll go bop. Right. Okay. That's fine, isn't it? Okay, right, this is easy anyway. We know what we're doing. Yep. Brilliant. Right, I'll see you in ten? Yep. Ten minutes. Ten minutes. Ten. Brilliant. Okay. Bobby, which side has no joints? Right, back to present day and on with the task in hand. We literally had no idea how we were going to tackle this, but we said we would, so we shall. All we knew is that we couldn't have joints on one of these sides. Which side that is, I'm not entirely sure. It's going well so far, guys. We had to pick up the pace if we were going to get this done before Dave's 10 minute deadline. What's happened there then? What's that? Well, it's where it dips. Can we cut a piece or? Maybe. Oh, God. What do you mean, oh, God? Actually, isn't that. You're not going to see that at that's all, what are you? I'm yeah, I don't think, I think that's irrelevant. Okay, so it might have. Hey, well, why am I saying that it looks dodgy? It didn't look dodgy. I did a great job. Why are you making me say that it looks dodgy? Who's letting Connor write these titles? Okay, so it might have looked a bit dodgy. But as we said, these sides aren't going to be shown. So after a bit more glue sprayed on the sides, we were done. Oh, but I gave it a little haircut before showing Dave. Yeah, it. And it's done, so that's the main thing. Okay, how did you find it? Yeah, we found it, yeah. It's been found. Look at that. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah. Can see the other side? The good side, yeah. Wow. That's a first attempt, that's not too bad, is it? 
There's a lot of join near the edge, isn't there, but we won't see that. Don't well, see there it. you go. A satisfied Dave happy with the work we'd done. So let's go and put it in you place. Didn't put it the right way around. How about we just wait and start and oh, oh. Are you all right? That's fantastic, that is. Are you happy with the work that we've done there? You can't even see the top bit. You can't even see. You can't yeah, unless see you, you when you look inside the cupboard. I think. Well, I'm looking inside the cupboard now. That's, that's a good job, that is. Yay! Out of ten. Oh no. Why? Because he's going to give me a six and a half. Well, I, I think that's a six and a half. I think the, for the bit that matters, I'm going to give you an 8 out of 10 on that. Now that's out of the way, our next job is to create the step into the van. We're going to put lights in the step so we can have an outdoor mood lighting and also see at night time. At first we used some of the flooring thinking it would look smart and just flow out nicely. But once I glued around the wood and cut out the edges, we were having second thoughts. Lovely. Is it though? Mm. There's a trim going on it. Well it's ugly. I, I personally don't like the, the whole use the floor in. I thought it would flow but I forgot that it had to have the trim on the edge so it doesn't actually flow and it, it looks terrible because of the, the design. After a failed attempt and a short conversation we realised it would look better left plain, white and wooden. And now that we'd had that realisation we got straight on with the new pieces. I started off by marking the holes for the lights with the old piece to save some time. Well this is fun isn't it? I got there in the end. Now I pressed a bit harder and actually cut the holes for the lights to sit in. Although I have to say, Dave did not look impressed. <laughs> the only problem I have with this method is it leaves stupid pieces of wood in the end and it's impossible to get out. I'm going to have to step back a bit, this looks dangerous. You're, you're, no, uh, you're making me nervous there, don't f*** yourself. In the I'll just carry on with what I'm doing. Okay. <laughs> Connor did eventually get it out. And I went again. Same again then. Whoa, here we go. Woo! Look at that. Woo! Yeah. It's like a tiny version of what's in the room. Now that we know that the lights would fit in the holes I'd created, we offered it up to see what we were working wow, with. Wow, that's... It's nice. Comfy. Yeah. Sorry, would you like a seat? These are like the sort of chairs if you fart on them, they're like really rash. <laughs> yeah, oh, you'll I'm hear it. Happy, yeah, you'll hear it. You want the front to still look solid but you need to take some off the back there yeah no no problem is that with the hand sander that i wanted in the first place I can, do you want the hand sander possibly right i'll get you the hand sander despite being told that i needed to use the bigger sander i decided this job could be done with a much smaller version but of course no one agreed i, I well i'll give you I'll, I'll give you that but i think you're probably gonna have to make another one of these i think you doubt me too much he's not happy with you if you would have just you know used the one that he he said. Right, go on. Terrible idea. I think that's going to be so uneven. I don't know so if that this, matters. This rate, apart from the fact that your hair's about to get caught in the drill, it's going to take about 15 minutes. We don't. We ain't got that time. This is a ridiculous thing to do. He's not giving me the right grain. There's barely any grain. I on told that. you there's one type, and you've got the one type with the thing that I said don't yeah, use well, because it's a ridiculous all idea. All I'm saying is, well, don't old say. All you you shouldn't have told is. me to use this. I, I should have been using you this all the time. Eventually, I gave in, but I'm sticking to my guns and saying that with enough time, I could have done it. I'm trying not to be involved, but it's painful. Right, you're trying to do an angle. You've even you've got a piece here. You're trying to do that sort of thing. You're doing. not going to get that sort of thing doing it flat. No matter how much these guys doubted me, I carried on. And you know what? I bloody nailed it. <laughs> well done, Bobby. Thank you. Right, this one's going to take a lot more skill because you've got to do the old... Uh, beep, 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 beep. I'm not sure how I feel about that. That is fabulous, that is. Shall we offer it up? Yeah. I did this. No. No, no. one cares. Oh, that is so 
off. Is it actually? No, it's wonderful. Look at that. Oh, that's perfect. That is perfect. So Something tells me Liana was bored of watching me do all the work, so she did more cutting by herself whilst I carried on. Although, I'm not sure she did a great job this time. I don't know why, but it doesn't look straight. Was it not meant to be straight? I don't know, is that not straight? I have a feeling there might have been a slight angle on that one. So you might not have done it. Don't put yourself down yet. Oh, look at that. I've got a holy step. So we have been left by ourselves again by Dave. What? How are you by yourself? I'm, I'm just there. Because he's taken on another odd job with his friend installing some windows into a VW. So... You'll be fine. I'm here. Just don't ask any questions. So, we're going to finish the step. Sand, prime, paint, splodge. Yeah. Let's do it. What could possibly go wrong? So whilst Dave was cutting the world's loudest windows... We got straight to work sanding and priming the wood. Although Connor wasn't happy with the quality of brush that David supplied us oh, with. using bristles, man? Look at that! But we carried on anyway. Connor just picked them out as we went along. Once we'd finished priming, we got to painting. We're making this the same colour as our wall, so hopefully it will blend in nicely. The last piece that needs hoovering. Apparently Connor's got a great idea. You've got to hoover it to make sure that none of the oh, yeah, dust the gets stuck to the paint. But this is the perfect hooverable side. It actually looks in the end. You get all the dust off. Clogged Dave's Hoover. Sorry, Dave. So we could paint the corner piece the same colour as the units. We thought it would be a nice pop of colour. Whilst we're waiting for the paint to dry, Dave has told us off and sent us upstairs because apparently we left a mess yesterday. <laughs> Do you remember leaving a mess? Well, I accidentally squirted some glue on the wall and I don't think he's noticed, so I hopefully I did a good job of cleaning it off the wall. Oh my god, you did that? He's gonna watch this video and know. How did you do it? We weren't even working out here. Well, I was carrying stuff down and I accidentally squirted in between my arm and it went. <laughs> It's not that bad, it's just bits of stuff everywhere. In true Connor and the Anna style, we came up with a great way to get this mess cleared up quick. So we collected all that we could and went through to the other room. I don't think he's going to be happy about this. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> we thought it'd be multiple trips if we brought it down, so... <laughs> so you thought you'd throw it at us? And you've broken the WD-40, <laughs> ruined. Well, it was it was Liana. To, I will. Well, I, yeah, I don't, I, I don't hold you responsible, Connor. You Thank can you. do something like that. No, <laughs> I'm just a videographer, you see. Yeah. I show up. What's happened, Dave? Well, we're not sure. My phone's inside the wall of the van. Your phone, which was, which was serving as a torch. It, it was a torch. <laughs> How have you done that? Were you balancing it in the crev? Were you, it were you balancing doing, were you doing it? Like that? It was it was on the inside, and then that's amazing. <sighs> that behind you there is there a slightly bigger one than that, please? The worst part of all of this, your tea's getting cold. Yeah, pass it in. Oh, you can't have that. That would ruin yeah. your day. They're the only two that remotely resemble. No, the you're looking there. at the wrong end. They are exactly the same, Eddie. <laughs> Just another day at the workshop, really, isn't it? Well, Gareth's here. <laughs> Yay! Miss Cole from Gareth. We're now going to install a plug and do a bit of wiring. So this is for our internet. And I know all the colours. Neutral, blue-trill, brown, live. And earth is yellow and green. Yeah, it is. Yeah. Dave then gave us a brief explanation of what the tools did, and of course we completely zoned out and pretended to listen. Let's say you're gonna want maybe. Right, did you get all that? Yeah. Right, he said we've got to do this square, but we're not using a, a, a leveler. So. Square schmear. Square pair. Is that square? The the actual switch itself is definitely square. Is this funny to you? Is it? No. Oh, look what you've done now. You've distracted me. Sorry. Not everything's about food, well, you know. Well, uh, it's, it's not. No, you're right about that. Tea, mostly. Then food, and then this. Um, so we can forget about this for now. What, what, you, what are you doing for food? You I've eaten. For food? You've eaten? We've had a sandwich this We've morning. Had a sandwich. Right, so I'm the only one who wasn't prepared. Just have more tea. It tends to be filling. No, if you have... Gareth's brought some food, so he's, he's 
he's gonna share what he's brought with me. And there's a burger still from yesterday, so I could just oh, you can have that. Microwave just microwave it. it. Microwave the raw burger. That could be awful, but I couldn't see. <laughs> yeah. Right, I've got something to do right, here, you, you know. You crack on. Right, back to back to where I was. Use this? Absolutely not. Was it this one or that one, or was it both of them? It was, was it that one, one first? first. This one first. Yeah, that takes the end off the wire. This way. Towards the end, yeah. That way. I think so. Like that. Um. Yeah, I want to see. Yeah. No, I want to see the other way. That's it. Oh, get it behind the red. Behind the red. That's it. What's going on? <laughs> Pardon? What's going on? Right, we're doing something wrong here. I think you might have missed one. I think we were using the wrong tool because I'm pretty, yeah, I think that was it, but how's that work? Um. We're not very good at this, are we? Oh, he did do that, didn't he? I think so. I don't think you've done anything there. Oh, you have? <gasps> <gasps> Yay! Yay! You did it, well done. I know, thank you. That was stressful. Nice. We're rocking and rolling now. Well, careful you get electric shock. So I like it. Live was potato. Yes. Will I be able to see if this works? That was a horrible noise. Wow, look at that. Now you just need to put the screws in. Woo! We did it. We did a plug. We Whether don't it, it works, works or yeah. not. Different question. We wanted to show Dave the amazing job we'd done, but of course Connor forgot to press record. Right, I know you've not seen it yet. Take two. No, you've All not. Alright, take one. Yeah, you've not okay. seen it yet. Take one. Whoa! That is a good job. Right, where's Robot Dave come from? Because... Is that, is that not convincing? Well, you sound sarcastic now, like it's okay, not a good right. job. Oh, oh, I've, I've not plugged in. Did you get the colours right? I'll yeah. The right, the right way around. Blue's yeah. earth. Um, red. <laughs> <laughs> and just as we thought we were done, we had another box to put in the cupboard. So uh, this is for the Ethernet cable itself. And of course, it was a complete disaster. <laughs> well, how's that happened then? <laughs> it's gone. It's gone through the casing. I'm not happy with that quality. We need a new van now. I did. We'll get another case. I'll go and get another case now. Is there actually another one? Don't tell Dave. All right. He's gonna watch this video. Right, attempt number two. Surely this time things couldn't go wrong. I think we're gonna need a bigger tool to do this. Yeah, that's good, that's good. You did good. it, you did it, you did it. That's good. Lovely. I thought I was gonna have to get another one, but I did it. It was more bigger than that, though. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing to see here. <laughs> Nothing to see here. <laughs> Nothing. He's coming. <laughs> What? Oh, what's happened here? <laughs> Who's done that? What? How have you brand, done that? Brand new one? Is, is, that, is that the one? No, that's not the one. That's the old one, isn't it? Yeah, that, yeah. That's the old one. I'm just going to go over here where the box is for the new ones. What's that? Where have you found that? What? What is that? How have you done that? Two? To... <laughs> that's a lot of money that is for two of them. I can't believe that's happened. Do you want to do it or should I? Oh, well, right. you haven't let me have a go. Liana ensured us she was the girl for the job, so she gave it a go herself. And surely after seeing me fail twice, she couldn't mess up again. You split the case at the top. Where? <laughs> we eventually decided it was probably best if we let Dave do the whole making this time as we'd gone through three cases already. Right, there's new tools here that he didn't tell us about. So. Why are you setting us up I with would normally have to resort to this, but you well, why can't you use the machine that we were using? Oh, then. It's going to be like that. It'll challenge me. And with Dave accepting the challenge, he started to drill the hole through the casing. And can you guess what happened next? He absolutely smashed it. Of course he did. Anyway, we had a job to do, so moving beyond our mistakes, we again had to screw the case to the inside of the cupboard. And that is another job done. We're doing these jobs by ourselves now. We're very proud of ourselves. I've, I've, I've seen that Crumble's just arrived. Crumble's arrived. Crumble door's here. Crumble door. Crumble door, I love it. That's good timing, how did you know? Crumble door. Crumble! I'm quite excited, but 
how much custard did you bring? I brought a carton of custard. Right. Yes. I was, just, I was thinking about it. You could have like hacked the system. So instead of making eight massive crumbles, you could have made eight then, single portions. I did. I did well, we, we, we wouldn't have been happy about we've that. We've had advice on that, haven't we, from people saying that's how we should do it. But that's, mm. I think it's cheating. I would. Yeah. Eight but full then size you can crumbles. Imagine yeah. How disappointed Dave would be. Yeah. 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 Well, just yeah. Wouldn't let me. If you're confused about the whole crumble situation, Dave made a bet with Liana that if you got the ball in the elephant, she'd have to make his tea for him for the rest of the week. But if you missed, Helen would have to make crumble. Helen has to make me a crumble. <laughs> oh, Helen's involved in the bet without knowing. It's fair. I'm all right with that. Somehow this led to Helen making eight crumbles without even being present for the bet. Dave did end up missing the shot, therefore losing the bet he made on Helen's behalf, but decided he wanted to play double or quit. Looks like you're getting a crumble. Wait till Helen finds out. Oh, double crumble! <laughs> Two crumbles! <laughs> Yes, uh, Helen. Get here soon. <laughs> yeah. It's gonna be a full-time crumbler at this rate. Oh, he's rimmed it. Can we have four crumbles? One for Helen herself. So Dave was quick to tell us that we did a terrible paint job yesterday, which I can accept. It was pretty bad. It's been rectified. This. This looks great. Okay, so quick side piece. We painted this bit green to try and add some contrast around the trim. However, it's disgusting. But Dave wanted to get Helen's honest reaction on camera, so we pretended that we loved it. Of, uh, that green accent thing. Oh, I love it. That's nice. I don't mind it. Um, what do we think? I actually don't mind it. It's uh, not going to be that colour, obviously. You are joking, right? <laughs> What's wrong with that? You're going green on that. Okay. We just thought it would be a bit of an accent, almost. We're not... Something's telling me she's not impressed. All right, Dave, we already know you weren't happy with our paint job. No need to rub salt in the wounds. We actually had a really cool idea for the step, which we'll see in a future episode. But for now, it's crumble time. And I think Cozy was more excited than anyone. Okie dokie. Mm -hmm. yeah. That is good. We would like to thank Helen, Crumble Door, from the bottom of our hearts. Making the crumble. Really nice. But now we've got to carry on with where we left off. With one out of eight crumbles aside, we were determined to get this step finished before we end the week. So that means fitting everything into place and getting the lights in and wired up. I was using cable clips to hold the cable for the lights in place alongside the step. Then we cut the casing off the wire, which I let Dave do as I did not trust myself. Then I clipped the ends of the wires into the clip thing that Dave gave me before. Yeah, very technical. Job done that. Well, I'm proper giving them bowls a scrub. Put one wash up. And then she's putting the kettle on as well, or is that a... Baby, man, she's made us a whole right, crumble. Yes, right, here she is, look. How do you know? Dave's just asked if you're going to put the kettle on now. I, I, one, I wouldn't say that. I'd think it, but I wouldn't say it. I'd say that's quite rude after you I'd made that crumble. Oh, yeah. crumble. and washed up. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Come on. That's out of order. That's exactly what I just said. Yeah, to be fair. I think, I think if anything, you much. should make Helen a, a warm drink. And while she's doing that, you could make me one because you're already there. I'm busy though, aren't I? That's true. I've got the baby. That's true. And I'm obviously also holding the camera and... Well, that just leaves Helen it, then. <laughs> <laughs> Back to square one. You know what? This is why I'm barely a bit. <laughs> Basically, have you got the stuff to make a crumble for tomorrow? Daily oh, crumble. No, 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 no not for everyone. At the end there. Yeah, but just as a kind of... Is there, like, you might have had just enough left over for a small crumble. It could have just been a Sunday crumble, not part of the bet. Oh, oh just yeah. in between oh, crumbles. Yeah, just like keep your hand in so you don't your standards don't drop between between crumbles. Just I was just suggesting. I feel like it. next one you're not getting any. Once we sorted out that complete misunderstanding, I cut some wire casing, and then I had the pleasure of twisting the two wires together. Once again I clipped them into this plastic thing, and Dave put it into place. So these ones aren't pushed in yet, but these are. We're gonna get some power to them and see if they work. I'm sure they will. The moment of tooth. You ready for this? Amazing moment. Ready when you are. Yeah. Whoa! Woo! Yeah! Woo! That means I twisted the wire well. You did. Well done. So I'm sure everyone will be very sad to know that we are over halfway done with this van conversion. I think we've got three weeks left. We're really fighting against the clock on this one because we've actually booked... Three weeks? We haven't got three weeks. We haven't got three weeks. Less than three weeks. We've got two weeks left because we've actually booked somewhere to go. So, <laughs> you better get working, Dave. You shouldn't have booked somewhere, should you? So let's have a look at what we've done so far. 
and what's left to do. Ceiling is complete. Walls mostly done, but they do need another lick of paint. Obviously our windows are in, our window frames are in. The wiring through the garage is more or less done. Look at that. I mean, it looks like a bit of a shambles at the minute, but we will, well, Dave will get there. <laughs> our lights are in and some of them have been tested. Some of them haven't yet. So obviously you'll remember we tested these ones and we have tested these ones. So the ones in the garage haven't been tested. All the others have. The water system is in, but we still need to hook up the tap and the shower. This worktop is almost on, it just needs sealing, and then this will be our sink, but we're not quite there yet. And the tap will literally just sit here and then come over. And oh. I get one of them taps. What are they called, Dave? A pull out tap. A pull out tap, yes. So a lot of you have been asking, where is Cozy going to sleep? So Cozy will be sleeping in a travel cot for the foreseeable, but these chairs are in, we just need to build a little box around them and then once he gets a bit older this will actually transform into a little toddler bed so that is where he will sleep after he's outgrown. A cot. I did my research and I've got the, well I, I think it's the best cot with the best mattress so I mean he loved it, we've already tried it and he loved it and he slept all night so. Our internet is in, obviously the cupboards are all in but we need our cupboard doors to hide all of our mess that's going to be in there. Same with here, we're going to need a cupboard door to hide my mess of a top job. We've got our microwave in, priorities. We've got the fridge, priorities. The bigger fridge the that bi we well, want. Well, yeah, look at, look at that. It's very That's spacious. That's fantastic, that is. We need cupboard doors on here. They also then need to be child-proofing. They, they need to be child-proofed. <laughs> the corners and the ceiling need to be boxed in, which hasn't been done yet. So the bed slats need to be finished and a mattress is on the way for the top of the bed. So I don't know if this is a strange way of doing it, but it's how we've decided to do it. The garage needs trimming and obviously all this mess is going to be hidden, but we've decided we've got this little section down here where you will see a very nice precise square. Under here we are going to have our portal in, and so there's going to be a little door here to pull it out. Um, I think in particular, because obviously Cozy's going to be sleeping on that end of the van, we wanted to be able to go to the toilet without disturbing him. Because if you remember in Floyd... Oh, this is definitely a first, isn't it, Cozy? We're all having a family <laughs> wee. The toilet was right by the door. So here we have our hot water heating, water level gauge and waste tank. And then on these three buttons, we've got a fridge, the water pump and inverter on and off. We've then got a 12 volt plug so I can blow up my kayak that Connor's going to let me buy. Right. And some USB slots. There is then going to be some USB slots down here. We're going to have a plug here, plug here, switches here, and our table is going to go here, which is going to be movable, and we're going to have a mount outside as well, so when we have barbecues, we're going to have an accessible table. And this right here is where the main light switch is going to be. You'll obviously remember that we've done the swivel chairs because that was an absolute nightmare. We've still got to fully box in the seats. We've kind of like half done that. So if you follow me outside, we've got the brackets on there, but the awning needs to be fitted, and I think the solar panel needs fitting as well because I think it's just kind of And like... the Starlink. Oh, and the Starlink because it's just kind of like sat on there at the minute. And I think that's about where we're at, but like I said, what are we, two and a half weeks? I don't even think it's that. We've got less. We're nearly in September. <sighs> Stay tuned. Yeah.